what we're developing is a small, lightweight, cost-effective lure block that can last for long periods of time without depletion issues in the field. So we've just got a simple plastic Nara lure block and we're testing different treatment options to make these lures last for extended periods. So we're soaking them in various different mixtures to figure out which is the most attractive for different species. And these lures will then be placed in things like traditional tracking tunnels, as well as new technology, like our critter pick units here. So the way this works is the lures put at the end of the box. The animal can't access it, but it's got some perforated plastic so they can smell the scent. And we're able to look at the interactions real time as they come in, so as different mice, possums, rats, stoats come to these boxes, we're able to look at the, the photos we collect. It's a great way of analysing what different scents might work really well and how long these re remain attractive in the environment. It's a biodegradable plastic polymer which is designed to be inedible for target species and we've developed several different treatment op options that we're using to infuse these plastic polymers to make them last for incredibly long periods of time. And what's also key is that the scent profile is the same at day zero as it is at day 200. A lot of the cost in terms of pest control in New Zealand is actually the labour involved to go and refresh laws constantly. We have been developing a product that is at least as effective as those current best practice laws, like peanut butter. So we're looking at something that's as good as that, but lasts for much longer periods of time. So you'd only have to refresh them, say, once or twice a year, rather than every few weeks. Mm -hmm.